Broadway has been in this location since 1950, but they go back to 1890 in Lubbock. So there's a very rich history. Uh, Broadway was instrumental in opening the Children's Home of Lubbock and also Lubbock Christian Schools and Lubbock Christian University. We like to know our history, but we want to really look to the future. Michelle Thomas knows a lot about Broadway Church of Christ and how the church supports our community. My title is Ministry Coordinator, and basically what I do, I work with all of the ministries that we have here. And so I work with the volunteers that basically lead a lot of different ministries here at Broadway. The church's outreach includes a partnership with Ramirez Elementary. Our main contact with them has been our trunk or treat. 2011, 2012, we decided to invite the schools that were in our area. And we did that to Ramirez and to Dupree. Up until COVID, uh, that was very, very successful. Unfortunately, like everybody else, COVID really messed up our outreach in that area to the schools especially. But now Broadway Church of Christ is reconnecting with Ramirez. This past year, we sent invitation to Ramirez. We had over 500 people come. Wow. We were not, we didn't know what to expect <laughs> because last two years we haven't done it. Right. And uh, we had like 300 hot dogs and they were gone like in 30 minutes. <laughs> Station One, the Lubbock Fire Department, uh -huh. comes out uh, every year and they set, have their truck there that kids can go look at it. We usually have between 15 and 20 trunks. And this year we had like an indoor carnival. It was very successful. We were pretty well overwhelmed. And I attribute that to Ramirez. Uh, to a lot of people, a lot of families getting out. Beyond Halloween, the church also supported staff at Ramirez, and it's something they look forward to doing again. Several times during the year, we would take uh, drinks over for the staff. We would take uh, snacks and different things like that just to try to help the, the staff and, and uh, faculty there uh, kind of encourage them. Um, COVID then put a stop to that. That's something we're wanting to try to develop more. Okay. Like I said, our new children's minister uh, is just now getting her feet uh, planted pretty well. And uh, she has some desires to do some things in the summer with kids, but also our youth minister wants to develop more with the faculty.